Bill, I have to I have to be honest. I didn't recognize that was the Camry. Uh, take me through the redesign because this is your flagship model. Well, striking new eighth generation Camry will, eighth. Wow. will be on sale late summer, early fall. Yeah. So really excited. It's an all new platform, so we're able to redo the whole car. The sheet metal, uh, new engines, transmission, suspension, technology, safety. It's got all of our latest. It's going to be a great eighth generation car, and we're really, really excited. Not only from the striking design, but it's going to drive a whole lot better, and I think it will really raise the bar for the whole midsize car category once we launch it. What's the thought behind making it more aggressive? Because I. Like I said, I, I've never seen a Camry like that before. Well, I think it's just uh, the, the, the whole category's evolved. It's, uh, people are looking for a little bit more of a dynamic design, more fun to drive vehicle, even in a mid-sized car. So I think we were able to add all the features and benefits that they're looking for, but added some eyeball and some driving improvement and appeal to it. So sure. I think it's really going to resonate in the market. How did the sales look for, a cam for the Camry? I know we've seen a lot of competition from these crossover SUVs. Yeah. How is that doing? There's been some outflow in the car market over to the uh, sport utility market. Sure. Uh, most of that's been out of the mid-sized car segment, yeah. but Camry is still the best-selling car in America. Uh, 15 years in a row last year and leads the car category through the first quarter of this year. So Camry's holding up really well and will really be supplemented when we get this new one out in the summer. Yeah, we're gonna take a walk. We'll check out some yeah. couple other things, but uh, is there any autonomous driving in the Camry or any other ones that you've infused, let's say in the Corolla? Well, I think what we've been able to add is our Toyota Safety Sense, yeah. which is now standard in a lot of our vehicles and will be standard in almost all Toyotas by the end of the year, mm -hmm. which adds the pre-collision technology along with uh, some other great new safety features. So I think that's, that's a little bit of how the autonomous vehicle vehicle technology sure. is coming into the mainstream part of America and really providing some great safety yeah. equipment into really mainstream vehicles here in the market. I mean, Toyota, take us through it. How does the autonomous plan look like for you guys? Do you have, how far are you away from semi-autonomous cars or fully autonomous? Is that just a pipe dream at this point? No, it's not a pipe dream. I think we're taking it in two basic steps. The first one is going to be kind of a driver assisted step mm -hmm. where you start to see a little bit of this TSS coming into mainstream vehicles and then that will be added on over the next couple of years. And then the, the fully autonomous vehicle will follow after that. Um, that's still going to take some time. I mean, we, we got our first patent in autonomous vehicles over 10 years ago. So this has been a, an evolving technology play in the industry but it's I think it's here you know it's going to be here for consumers soon in the short term in great safety additions to mainstream vehicles like I just mentioned and longer term these cars are going to drive you unbelievable lastly take us through this extreme Corolla is this a production model am I going to be able to go drifting in this I've never seen I've never seen this one either we built this for the SEMA show gotcha. which is the specialty okay. equipment show in, uh -huh. in Vegas every year got a lot of great feedback and eyeballs on it so we, we get a chance to bring it around to other auto shows around the year. You know, Corolla buyers really look at this and they, say, they wow. Amp these, they amp these up in the aftermarket. I yeah. mean, they really do a job on a lot of these cars. Yeah. So it's if you ever have a chance, go to SEMA. You're going to see some amazing vehicles and what uh, all the uh, business partners and suppliers do in this industry. But it's really made a great-looking Corolla even, even more appealing yeah. and pretty, pretty wow there. I got to grab some selfies with it. But thanks for taking time. I appreciate okay. it. Great to see Thank you. Thank you.